In this video, I'm going to show you how to use text effects in Canva. And these are some of the effects we will achieve by the end of this video. So, if you want to learn how to use text effects in Canva, keep watching. Hello guys, this is Sonic here from Template Warriors. On this channel, we help you create and sell digital products online and also help small businesses grow using their right digital tools through online video just like this one. So if you are new here, consider subscribing. That said, let's jump into the video. I've already added some text for this demonstration. So to get started, I just select the text and up here, I have text effects. I click on it. And these are the various text effects. So the first one is shadow. To apply it, I simply have to click on it. And you see that I now have a shadow on my text. Awesome. You can also use other features like offset, direction, blur, transparency, and even change the color of the shadow. So let's start with offset. At the moment, it is set to 50. I can take it backwards. As you can see, meaning I don't have any shadow. If I go towards the right, see that the shadow is moving away from the text. Awesome. I leave it as 50. Next is direction. As you can see. So whichever direction you want to take your shadow, you just have to be creative in order to come out with your own designs. Blair. Perfect. All right, transparency. So if you get to the end, it will become more darker. Awesome. You can change the color. Next, let's take a look at lift. So I select the text. I go over to effects. And I choose lift and with the lift you only have one feature that is intensity so I can take it to down to the end or I can increase it perfect so that's all about the lift next is hollow I have hollow right here so with this you won't have any feel as the name suggests and you can go ahead and increase or decrease the thickness of the outline. Perfect. Next, I have splice. With splice, you have a fill in the text, which is sort of moved away from the outline of the text. You can play with the thickness, offset, direction, and color. So first of all, let's see the thickness. Perfect. Awesome. You can also change the color like this. Perfect. Next is echo. Echo is similar to shadow, but this time around you have more than one shadow as you can see. And you can change the offset. The direction. color next we have glitch you can play with the offset direction And finally color so you have these two preset colors the first one is selected let's see the second one perfect 
If you are finding value so far, please give this video a thumbs up. It does help me out so that the video will be suggested to more people on YouTube and also benefit more people. All right, let's continue. Next, we have Neon. So this is how Neon will look like. Awesome. Take note, you can also go ahead and change the colors of the text itself. So I go to text color and I can choose whatever color I want. And this is kind of cool. Perfect. Next is background. Text effects. Background. And you have a background behind your text. You can play with the roundness. So by taking it to zero, I have a rectangular shape. So if I want to add some roundness, I take it towards the right. So as I go, the roundness is applying. Perfect. You can also play with spread. You can play with transparency. Awesome. And finally, color. Perfect. Last on the list is curve text. So after selecting, you just click on curve and your text will be curved. Then we go ahead and add a rounded shape. So I go over to elements. Then I go ahead and click on the circle. I move it down a bit and I increase the size. Maybe something like this. Now I can play with my text by selecting it effects so i can play with the curve options perfect maybe i can move my text a little bit awesome so that's it on how to use text effects in canva you simply have to use them in your own creative way to come out with perfect designs all right that's it guys i hope you found value in today's video if you did kindly hit the like button subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and also enable the notification bell so that each time i post a new video on this channel you'll be the first to know keep watching and i'll see you in the next one